They said he wouldn't live past 18 months. You won't believe what he looks like today. Braden West was born with a rare and severe form of Pfeiffer syndrome, type 2, that caused abnormalities in his skull and brain development. Two weeks prior to his birth, Braden's mother Sherry was informed of the devastating news. In an interview with News Nation Now in 2020, Sherry spoke about the fear and uncertainty she experienced. I was praying for God to take him home as I could feel him kicking inside me. It was a dire situation as it appeared that he wouldn't have the back of his head and would be born with teeth. But as soon as Brayden was born, Sherry formed a deep bond with her special boy. However, she also felt helpless in her efforts to save him. Unfortunately, many children with Brayden's condition do not survive past birth and in Brayden's case, he was only expected to live for 18 months at most. I prayed to God and asked him to let me have Brayden for just a little while, Sherry recalled. Sherry spoke to the Owensboro Times and shared a photo of Brayden at birth highlighting the distinct clover shape of his skull. At one month old, we were allowed to bring him home, she said. Despite the fact that he wasn't thriving, the doctors knew he wouldn't survive in the hospital so we took him home to introduce him to our loved ones. But despite the odds stacked against him, Brayden has been making remarkable progress since his birth. Thanks to the support of his loving family, he has defied expectations and started to show signs of improvement. Brayden underwent over 30 surgeries and received a tracheotomy at just three months old, Sherry stated. There was even a procedure he underwent with only a 10% survival rate. We had to sign do not resuscitate papers and prepare for the worst, but to our surprise, the doctors emerged with good news. Brayden was okay. In addition to the support of his family, Brayden formed a special connection with registered nurse Michelle Eddings Lynn. When Brayden was a baby, his health declined and his future looked uncertain. But with faith in God, Sherry and her family were able to overcome the difficult challenges. People were praying for us and it's amazing what you can get through with faith, Sherry said. Michelle was with Brayden the night he came close to losing his life. I remember praying, Lord, either take him home or make him better because no one could bear to see him suffer any longer, she said. Michelle was overjoyed when Brayden pulled through that night as he became her first patient to leave hospice care. The bond between Brayden and Michelle grew so strong that Brayden even asked her, whom he referred to as his angel, to take his senior photos. 17 years ago, I cried because I thought his time on earth was ending, but now I'm crying because he's graduating from high school and his life is just beginning," Lynn wrote on Facebook. Watching him become this amazing young man has been emotional, but I'm so proud, Sherry told the Epoch Times. When I saw him walking across the stage, every emotion from the first few months of his life came flooding back. I never thought he would be able to hold a pencil, speak, see, or hear, but here he is doing all those things. To commemorate Brayden's extraordinary accomplishment, his parents arranged for him to be flown in by helicopter to the middle of a live concert featuring one of his favorite musicians, country singer Cam Thompson. Brayden, who persevered through many obstacles, referred to his graduation day as perfect. I'm proud of myself for working hard and overcoming difficulties to reach this day, Brayden said. Despite the challenges he faced, including walking with a walker until he was five and needing therapy to learn to walk on his own, Brayden is now a member of the Civil Air Patrol Unit in Owensboro, Kentucky. With the firefighting profession being his lifelong dream, Brayden is living it out as a volunteer fireman with the Mosleyville Fire Department. Sherry, Brayden's mother, notes that her son's achievements serve as an inspiration to others who face seemingly insurmountable odds. Never give up, no matter how difficult the journey may seem, she said. Keep climbing because the view from the top is truly amazing. Brayden's faith and determination have not only helped him survive but also thrive, as demonstrated by his outstanding academic performance. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and consider sharing it with someone who may find it interesting. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.